we go. Once again, if you're not familiar, the boss is prevent is making all the enemies in this dungeon have a ridiculous amount of damage and a ridiculous amount of health. It's possible to kill them, but you get the same amount of XP each way, either way. So you're better off just sneaking through the dungeon, kill the boss, and then come in back here. It's not really worth wasting time trying to kill these guys when they can usually kill you in two hits, one hit most of the time. So you're better off just running through. Which is what you're supposed to do anyways. Save save yourself time. No need to be a hero. Hey, what's Stop. up, Ethan? Go back now while you still can. The plagued ones, they grow more powerful with every moment. You cannot battle them, for the shard gives them unimaginable strength. You must steal the shard. It is the only way. Move quietly and unseen to the other side of Mount Renador. Follow the Great Glacier to the Bastion of Thunder. It is there that they guard the source of their newfound power. You must remove the shard first, then avenge my people. Go with the gods, my friend, and don't let yourself be seen. Aye, aye, Cam. It's a few. I think you blew out my earbuds. Ah. Oh. Okay. I forget what the pattern is. Okay, checkpoint number one. A bunch of cabals. These guys are cabals. Oh no. Balls. Okay, that one I screwed up, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, I screwed that up, alright. Oh, I was hoping to make it. But it does run slightly faster than you. I don't have a charge. Okay, let's do this again. Okay, this guy saw me. Uh, I can never remember which way I want to go. There we go. There we go. You would think after doing this stupid part like 80 times that I would remember the path pattern okay I'm 
across there. And home free. Make sure I activate that. Make sure I get checkpoints. And then to the mountain pass, super bright glacier. How bright does that look? Uh, that doesn't seem too bad. It's a little bit bright, I guess. It's not bright on my screen, just recording it comes out bright. Whatever. You guys should be fine. Just, just put on some sunglasses when you watch this part. Man, that poison is so useful. I should probably get rid of the archer first. I have too much in my pack already. Really? Oh my gosh! I'm tempted to put another point in endurance. Welcome, my ch Well, I'm not maxed. Oh, it must have been like an armor piece that carries a lot. That weighs a lot, I should say. Uh, whatever. Either way, I'll be going back, so might as well just come back and sell. And it gives me an opportunity to equip anything new. That oh, I picked up a paltry misty glow. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Wow, really? I sold everything and I'm at and I'm at one fifty weight. The heck weighs so much. The cat figurines are sixteen. Those are eight. Although those are thirty, those are increasing my strength, which allows me to carry more. Just a lot of little things adding up. I mean, I should put points in their endurance. Because maxed out, it's like 300 pounds. Which is pretty good. Which is pretty nice. But I want to I wanna max out... Um, archery first. I just have to suffer with the, uh, the weight... <laughs> I kicked him. Okay. <clears throat> oh, so close. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Are we at four? Yes. Next level is four. Four arrows, 200%. Uh, I could do that. I could get dual wheel. Or I could increase the arrow weight reduction. Which my arrow's at 7%, but. Maxing that out. Maxing that out does help too. 
Ah, oh, 25. I would like to do that. 52%. Or you just get four arrows now, or you get four arrows. Or you can get endurance. Let's just get that. Whatever. Eventually I want that and the endurance maxed out anyways. Could have gotten multi arrows. Instantly get me four arrows, but that's fine. So four arrows divided by oh two hundred divided by four. That's what fifty. Fifty percent my weapon damage for each arrow. So if all four arrows hit, then it does more damage than my regular hit. But when you combine uh, piercing arrows, then it's great for crowds. Great all around, it's just expensive and eats through your arrows. I bet he doesn't have to worry about running out of arrows. Convenient. <laughs> Why am I just wasting arrows? Oh, I'm not wasting arrows. I wonder if I can get another level out of this place. It is pretty big. Um, yeah, I do want to go this way. Wait, do I want to go that way? Can't remember which way is the dead end. I have too much in my pack already. You know what, lady? <sighs> That's it. I'm putting. I'm Welcome, my child. But I'm pointing in endurance next level. Keep forgetting I could do that quick quick. Uh, I should have checked this out, but uh, I just I was just there. Oh, and I ate my... Man, imagine how many guys I'll accidentally hit, kill with piercing. Oh, I can't wait. Like a bear figuring. Right, at a glance. Okay.
I mean, if I went dual, I could I could shave off like five pounds, but the owl figuring and the uh, the cat figuring is what. What weighing weighing me down the most? Cause it's 30, 16 pounds. I don't really need them, but why not? A couple of endurance points that really shouldn't matter. Not prepare for the cat. Let's see, that made me jump. Pick up one more thing, and she already goes. You carry too much. I am going to flip a table. Really large, expensive table from China. All right. Ah, uh, um. <laughs> I do love these big straight paths because it's just possibility to get several kills with every missed arrow. So I'm, I'm glad I don't have a perfect aim. I see you just sitting there. Now I'm not quite getting as much experience as I was getting getting at the earlier part of this this play. Say you should always go left in the fork of the road, but I'm going right. Despite them. Although it looks like the middle path was the dead end. So let's go that way. Oh, well, I guess it doesn't really matter, huh? And you bring him back to life. <laughs> That's awesome. I hit him. Uh, hey, look at that. It was right. It was the right path. Okay. 
Ah, on to the final part. A lot of yaddies.